When we first visited the site, we were just struck by what an incredible pocket of Melbourne it was. So unique, just incredible number of trees on site, really a lot of native vegetation, wonderful bird life. Um, you know, it's such, so ripe for opportunities to really uh, create a building that just blended beautifully in with its environment. So it became pretty clear that one of the key sort of challenges, but also we all think of those as the opportunities, is how to bring beautiful light and the connection to the canopies of the trees, which are very, very tall. The key concepts became the idea of sight and light. So uh, sight, of course, being incredible existing um, trees and landscape and how to capture those views and the second being light and how to really draw natural light into the house and the concept became sort of a band running through the house at about 2.7 metre height um, so anything above that became a highlight window that drew, drew everyone's eyes up and out into the landscape and brought natural light into the spaces. So obviously the experience looking out through the windows at ground level is a lot of tree trunks but you really have to glance upwards to connect to the canopies and we feel really proud that that's probably you know a really key driver of the design as it ended up. Um, I think that's one of the qualities that, that we see is that maybe you guys help us see what we couldn't otherwise see. Um, so, and that was one thing, we were stuck in our head, we weren't going to knock down any trees, we weren't going to do any planning permits. Um, but, you know, you, you show the difference between the, the two options without tearing down trees. Um, and it made a massive difference to what we ended up with. For me, the floor plan is what makes this house so easy to live in. Everything has its place and even if all four of us are home at the same time, we have our own space to do what we need to do but we still feel like we're connected to each other. So that's the, a huge part of what makes this house so livable. I, I love the way it connects with the garden, the backyard. So whenever on a Saturday morning I'm thinking what I'm going to do out in the, out in the garden. But, um, but also it's got this inside-outside feel that I love so they're, they're connected. And I think that, that works really, really, really well. In the uh, Bellbird house, the Ryan family have a lot of hobbies and interests, so that meant um, we got to really finesse a plan that would really um, enable all of their passions and things they love to do, such as their very musical family, creative family, um, cooking and baking, um, and the idea of the kitchen being the centre of the home was really important as well. Um, we really loved um, making a music room. Yeah, so I have a music room and it's pretty special to me because I haven't had a room of my own since um, I, left, I left home. So, and it's just a beautiful space. So it looks out over the street, which is lovely because we don't have a lot of traffic and it's people walking their dogs and beautiful desk and place for all the things that I love to do. So I have my musical instruments in there and my sewing and all my books. And it's just a very serene and creative place to be and I love it. This is the third project that I've done with Bowra Architecture. We worked very closely also with the owners and I think that's sort of borne out in this lovely project and I'm very, very happy, very, very proud. I think if you look at the house, it's, it's amazing and it looks simple but there's an awful lot of things to get right um, all the way through the whole build to make sure that it, it comes out looking that simple. It all looks like it's been put together. It looks so simple, but as Cameron was saying, it's very heavily detailed. The, 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 there's so much detail, but it's all been resolved that it it just looks peaceful. You're not, you know, eyes not drawn to anything other than the beauty of the space, which I really like. Because it was just a really good working relationship with both you guys and with Crisp, and uh, I wouldn't have any hesitation recommending you to other people. No, I think, I think you guys were, were awesome. I think you listened, you let us come on the journey with you. Um, I couldn't, couldn't ask for more. And like we're wrapped with the project, we're wrapped with the way things came out. I, mean, I can't, can't wait to spend another 
two or three years here as the garden grows and it all starts to, to come together.